Hello and welcome, my fellow explorers of the Tarot. Today, we are diving deep into the mystical world of Tarot card readings and understanding the power of Tarot combinations. Just imagine, each Tarot spread is like a unique puzzle assembled with diverse cards from the deck, each holding a secret, a piece of a much larger, intricate story. We have nearly infinite possibilities of tarot combinations, and the beauty lies in the complexity of each spread. Depending on the cards you pull, you can derive countless answers to your questions. This video is your beginner's guide to understanding these basics. Let's delve into the different tarot combinations, shall we? It's essential to know how the different combinations work if you're eager to decipher your readings. See how you arrange the cards impacts your reading profoundly. Take the three card spread, for instance. Each card stands for a specific aspect of life, like past, present, or future. The cards you pull for each slot connects to that aspect. In a one card spread, it's straightforward. You pull one card and read its meaning. Then we have more elaborate spreads like the Celtic cross that can reveal precise and in-depth insights. Now, let's talk about how to interpret tarot cards. We know that the minor arcana cards are divided into four suits, each reflecting a universal element. Earth, air, wind and fire. To enhance the depth of your reading, understand the meanings of these elements. For example, if you pull a lot of fiery cards, the wands, your reading might be telling you something about passion and action, or perhaps their absence. Remember, major arcana cards refer to larger themes or energies, while minor arcana cards may hint at smaller details or temporary issues. Their combination can offer a profound insight into your reading. A simple trick for beginners is to assign a basic word to each card, like reflection with the hermit or adventure with the fool. Pulling these contradictory cards together could mean you need to balance solitude and adventure in your life. Try combining symbols from different cards. These symbols can have multiple meanings, depending on their context. Spotting similar symbols in your reading could add another layer to its overarching meaning. To sum it up, the tarot combinations you pull will shape your reading's meaning. The order you pull them in, the spread you use, will add clarity and depth to your reading. If all this feels overwhelming, don't worry. Remember, it's a journey and it takes time. Start by learning the meanings of different cards, like death, for instance. The rest will unfold with time. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the mystical world of tarot. Happy reading!